Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Randy Saves, and today I will show you my CVS haul for this week. The weekly sales ad starts today, which is October the 8th, and it ends on Saturday, which is October the 14th. So I just did a few deals. I did two transactions, and in the first transaction, I rolled a $3 beauty buck. And I am going to let you know what the prices should be. My prices were different because of some some uh, digital coupons that I will explain later. So let's go ahead and start. Um, the first deal that I took advantage of was the Tresemme. So they're on promotion this week. Um, all Tresemme and select Dove hair care products are on sale for buy one get one 50 percent off and there is a five dollar off a of three coupon that is printed out in the red box machine for everybody so um at my store um these tresemmes were priced at five dollars and 19 cents so for two of them ranked up at normal price which was 519 and then um the third one ranked up at 259 so for the three of them, the total was $12.97. And I used that $5 off a of three uh, red box machine coupon. And I also used a coupon that came in the inserts that expires today, October the 8th, for $5 off three Tresemme shampoo or conditioners. And then I also used a $2 off um, CVS coupon that I was able to print from the CVS site uh, after I completed a survey. So after those coupons, it was $0.97 cents for the three of them or $0.32 cents each. So I think that was a great deal there. Um, the next deal that I took advantage of was the Nivea Body Wash. So here it is in the ad. Nivea Body Wash, uh, the 6.8 or the 16.9 ounce is on sale for $2 for $8. And it is showing that there's a $3 off to manufacture coupon that uh, came out today. So obviously for the two of them, it was $8. I had a... Um, $3 off any Nivea Silk Mousse Body Wash personalized coupon and I use the manufacturer coupon for $2 off any uh, Silk Mousse Body Wash and then I had a $2 off a 6 body wash purchase so after those coupon it should have been a dollar or 50 cents each I will explain uh, later what my actual total was um, so if you do have all those coupons then you will pay 50 cents each which I think is a great deal considering the normal prices um, are I believe $5.49. Um, the next deal that I took advantage of was the Mitchum deodorant. So let me go ahead and show you in the ad. They're on sale this week for $2.99 and when you purchase one you will get a $1 extra care buck. There is a $1 manufacturer coupon. So the um, total after extra care buck should be $0.99. Cents. The limit for this offer is 3 So I decided to do it twice. So for the two of them, it was $5.98. And then I used two of the $1 off manufacturer coupon. And then I had a $1 off five um, any deodorant purchase. So the total should have been $2.98. And then I did get back the $2 extra care buck. So making it $0.49 cents each, which I think is a great deal. And last but not least, I uh, the second transaction, I purchased one personal. They are not in my ad or I'm not able to locate it in my ad and they were not tagged at my store but when I price checked it they were on sale for $4.99 and this is a 16 count capsule. They also have the liquid ones. So uh, $4.99 and then I used a $2 off one manufacturer coupon that expires today. So after that coupon it was $2.99 but I did get back a $1 extra care buck. The limit for that offer is one. So the final price after extra care bucks was $1.99 which I think is a great deal considering the regular price at my store for the caps is $8.29. So that's a great deal there. So um... My out of pocket should have been $7.94 and then I did receive $3 extra care buck so it should have been $4.94. Um, however, I had clipped some coupons to my card before I went to the store and um, the $3 off to Nivea did apply even though I did have the $2 manufacturer coupon for that. Um, so that is why this is my receipt here. So the first transaction should have been um, $4.95 um, and then after the extra care buck it should have been $1.95 um, but like I said um, it does show there that the $2 off of 6, uh, the $3 off Nivea um, adjusted down so 
And then the $1 off five deodorant did not apply because my subtotal was less than that. So I'm not sure what happened there, but I did give you the breakdown in case you do have the coupons. Your total should be for all of this $4.94 after extra care bucks. But I w wanted to show you my receipt. Um, on that and then in the second transaction, I just purchased a purse so everything went fine in that there's um, There was no digital coupons. It was just a dollar ninety nine plus tax So my total was two dollars and forty nine cents out of pocket But I did receive um, the two dollar from the Mitchum and the dollar from the purse So after that considering that this transaction was a 51 cent money maker for me So um, just keep that in mind um, if you did clip any coupons and using any coupons. I don't know what the system is doing. You do not supposed to use any manufactured coupon with any digital coupons because the digital coupons are considered manufactured coupons. So I'm not sure what's happening there. So I just wanted to make sure and let you know about that just in case you have some issues or some extra care bucks don't apply. But that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's a very small haul. Just remember that the Tresemme and the Persil uh, coupons expired today. So if you want to do that deal, make sure to go out today. And that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.